Hey everyone, I'm Naomi and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an airplane out of cardboard. Feel free to pause and re-watch parts of the video in case you are confused. And if you mess up, that's okay. We make mistakes to help us grow. The goal of this is to be creative and have fun. And it's okay if your airplane doesn't look like mine. Mine is just one way out of millions of ways to make this. So, are you ready? Let's get started. For this tutorial, you will need thin cardboard, something to write with, scissors, and tape. First, we'll make the fuselage, the body of the plane. Flip your cardboard over to the side without pictures. Draw what you want it to look like. Once you like your body design, cut it out. Save your cardboard scraps though. You might need them along the way. Next, we are going to make the wings. Get another piece of cardboard and fold it in half. That way, you only need to draw one wing shape, but be able to cut out two that are identical. Use the folded edge to help draw a straight line. Draw a curved triangle. Once you like your design, Cut out your shape, then cut it in half to make both wings. To attach the wings, you are going to make two L braces for each wing. Cut small rectangles out of the cardboard and fold in half. See? You made the letter L. Tape an L brace on the top and bottom of each wing. Make more L braces if you need and use more tape if you need. Now that both wings are attached, we are ready to make the horizontal stabilizer. Again, take another piece of cardboard and fold it in half. Draw once, cut once to make two of the same thing. Use the edge to draw a curved trapezoid. Sorry, the video got a little bit cut off, but you'll be able to see my finished piece in just a second. Once you have drawn your trapezoid, cut it out, cut down the middle, and you have two pieces. Again, you are going to make L braces to attach this to the back of the airplane. I had to make my L braces a little skinnier so that they would fit. Attach each part of the horizontal stabilizer on each side on the back of your airplane. We are almost done, but not yet. We need to make a rudder. Grab another piece of cardboard. We aren't going to fold this one in half this time since we're just making one rudder. Use the edge to help you draw a straight line. You're drawing half of a trapezoid. Cut out when you're done drawing. We're just going to tape this to one side of the airplane. No L brace. Time to fly. I hope you guys enjoyed this video tutorial for the cardboard airplane. And don't feel like your final design is the final design. You can make modifications to make your airplane even better. Try adding on paper clips to different parts of the airplane to change the weight. Maybe you need to add more tape to make it fly better. I had to do that with mine. You can even try, have a whole airport of airplanes that you've created that look entirely different. Have fun with this and try something in a different way. I'll see you later.